Hi guys, welcome to the boyfriend tag. I thought this was the perfect way to introduce Paul to you guys on my channel officially. You would have seen him on my social media, on my vlog, Snapchat, all that kind of stuff. And loads of you guys requested this video, one of my others. So I have finally got him here. Let us begin. Where did we meet? We met through mutual friends several years ago now. Five years? Mm. 2011. Yeah, five, eleven. We uh, we went for a drink. Not together. No, that was too soon. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the story going? What I meant to say is our friends were meeting for drinks and they brought Leanne along and that's how we met. And we were with partners at the time but then after those this stopped happening then we started hanging out everyone was like hurry up and be together and it took mm. us how many years to actually be wow. together but we're finally together okay <laughs> where was our first date what a official date yeah i used to try and take her on dates all the time she just didn't know um, we have to kind of make it more datey then. We were just hanging out. We never spoke about feelings and that kind of stuff. So we'd always just hang out and like speak about everything but that. I guess we arranged to go to London together. That was not our first date. What, we had a date before that? Yeah. Are we talking about when we're going out? Because I'm getting confused. No, as in like we had that date when you took me. I don't to count that, you see, because we weren't together, but. That's still a date. It was at the last wine bar and I was very, that? very nervous for some reason. But we hung out so much and then when it kind of got made into like a date, then you just got really like awkward around me. And I didn't know why, because I felt so comfortable with him. We just pretended like it never happened. That's why you don't count it. That went on for another year after that. I guess when we went to see Real Life Charm was kind of a date, but that was with friends yeah. there. That was the first time we were kind of out in public acting like a couple. We weren't even officially together, but we were holding hands, acting like boyfriend and girlfriend. Friend. That mm. was really nice. What was your first impression of me? I thought she was hot at the time, but obviously I didn't say anything because I had a girlfriend myself. It's quite bad, really. <laughs> <laughs> but no, she was obviously attractive. She's an attractive girl. Um, other than that, I thought you were very friendly. You were quick to, to talk to me. I thought he was very attractive. And I first actually noticed you had your nose pierced. I really like that. When did you meet the family? I met your mum first when, when we took her for dinner. We took her to the Virgin Lounge. And, and we, we had... went to Wagamama's as well. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And you didn't speak to my dad properly really till Christmas? Yeah, when dinner. I was invited over for dinner. Do I have any weird obsessions? If so, what? Well, at the moment, you're like marbling the whole house. <laughs> I've marbled most of the bathroom. How about you? Do you have any? You just love Blink-182. You can't say that. I sound like a 15 year old. That's nothing wrong with that. Still do like Blink-182, but not as much as I used to. I guess music is my obsession. You can't stop tapping. That's getting worse. I just want to give you a drum kit in a soundproof room to just get that out of your system. How long have we been together? Hey, you remember anniversary? Yes. Because you kept forgetting before. It's like a test question. 3rd of January. Yay! Well done. I'm flying, so we're having fun. Do you have a tradition? Well, it used to be wags. Basically every week or two weeks we'd go, have wagamamas, I go to the cinema. So we were practically going on dates, just without it being called a date. I wanted it to be a date every time. But you got to tell me that. I paid for the Or meals. like, act more than just friends. Yeah, we watch a lot of Netflix together. I did, that did come Stra up. Strange things. Stranger things. Stranger things. That we just watched in one whole go. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and we've recently been watching The Cosmos, which is... Amazing. I've actually mentioned that in my favourites video. Mind blowing. What was our first road trip? See so you're tapping. Stop it. Sorry. Southwold. And it rained. <laughs> and it rained. <laughs> and we didn't really know what to do and everything was kind of closed. We were trying to look for a cool cafe but we just ended up in Costa. We are only good at going to things that aren't a chain if it's recommended to us otherwise we play it safe. Like okay. in New York every day for breakfast. Starbucks. Not every day. Most days. I think two days we didn't. So six days we did. What was the first thing you noticed about me? Uh, your eyes. The makeup you do with your eyes. Like, you've said you've changed it now, but... Mm, it was very dark. It's, it's the shape and you, the colour of your eyes. I like brown eyes. Most people like blue eyes, green eyes, boring. I like brown eyes. I like blue eyes. <laughs> what is my favourite restaurant? Well, I'd like to say Wags. Wine Press? Yeah, we went there for my birthday as well. Who wears the pants in the relationship? Well, I don't wear pants. Ha <laughs> ha, you know what it means. I go commando. <laughs> 
you. I think it depends on the situation. Yeah. But I think most of the time... You lead the way. Oh no, I missed one. What do we argue about the most? We both can be on our phones a lot. Because you used to be bad. In the cinema, you used to be on your phone before we were together. And I had to take it off him and put it in my bag. If I'm watching TV, what am I watching? Or I guess Netflix. It's either the Cosmos or Big Bang Theory. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do on my I hands. think it's like a nervous thing. Sit on them. What is one food I don't like? Well, it's not that you don't like them. You're allergic to onions. You so I'm not like. fussy. I eat most things, apart from onions and... You literally eat everything. Ah, oh, some of the fishy things you eat. Ugh. I ate some earlier today. Ugh. I have cuttlefish, but it stinks. Another thing, what well, other than onion? Ugh. I say I'm a crap Asian because I can't eat... Spicy food? Yeah. What drink do I order when we go out to eat? We try Melbeck. For some reason in restaurants mm. they only sell it by the bowl and well, not the expensive. glass. That's expensive. You always look for... is it elderflower? Still Ooh, there. Yeah. That's something you always look for. Yeah. Aww, you remember. What size shoe do I wear? It depends. Heels like and free? flats. In... Free and heels? Yeah. Two in flat? No. <laughs> That's what I think. <laughs> I don't know. Four, four in flat. Yeah, and you're in eight? Yes. What's my favourite kind of sandwich? Something with prawns in. Oh, it's crayfish and rocket. Crayfish. Oh, you like like sweet chilli and chicken? Is that a wrap? That's more like a wrap, yeah. I like tuna sandwiches, chicken sandwiches, bacon sandwiches. That's All, of All of the sandwiches. <laughs> I don't like pickle. You know, that pickle and cheese. Oh, uh, oh geez, or egg and pickle crest. is so good. I'll, mm, you have to be in the right mood for that. What is one talent I have? <laughs> well. <laughs> <laughs> You're good at, like, being creative and making things, like, naturally. And when you made that wire thing behind us. Yeah. You're quite good at stuff like that. I'll link like below if you haven't seen that one. Um, yeah, you're quite sort of creative. Your photography is really good. I'm yet to hear her play violin. But now I've cut my nails, I can actually play again. I think your talents is definitely music and you have a very tuned ear. And you're good at your DJing as well. 19. What would I eat every day if I could? I don't know. If I could eat prawns in different ways every day. Mm. In different ways? Well, yeah, I couldn't just eat, like, just prawns by themselves. Oh, like, right, I get you. In a stir fry, you meant, a like, sandwich. Placing it in your mouth in a different way. <laughs> Upside down, laying down. Laying down. <laughs> <laughs> if you could literally get away with eating whatever you want every day. Can, can I say pancakes and then I can vary the pancake? Yeah. What is my favourite cereal? Cheerios. Yay, it is. What's yours? Oh, is yours, like... Lucky Charms. Those blueberry wheats. What is my favourite music? You, I have um, quite a varied taste, I think. Mm, you'll nod along to the music I listen to, which is a bit more rocky. Then you like your indie. You like Foles and bands like that. And then you like deep house music. And then you like Bieber. You like Bieber too! <laughs> <laughs> we were saying in the future, you know, if, if when we get I married. I do like late Bieber, like everyone else. I don't like early Bieber. I weren't a believer. I was saying. <laughs> it's what we argue about. <laughs> yeah, it is. I interrupt all the time. <laughs> I was going to say that, actually. He'll just, like, start daydreaming and then just talk. And I'm mid-talking and I'm like, oh, okay, you're talking now. Cool. I was going to say, when we get married... You said we had to play Bieber, not like walking down the aisle, but like at our dancing, not our first dance. But when we got together, we listened to his album like all the time. We did. Do we want Bieber at the wedding? A couple of songs. I think that's all right. Probably sound really dated by then. <laughs> How long is it? I've told him like four years. That's kind of, was it? No, three years. Three years. And then four years I wanted babies. Why are you leaning away from me? <laughs> <laughs> and your kind of favourite music is Blink-182. No. This is. So you've gone on that again. It I is. used to really like Blink-182, but I like a lot more than that and you know it. What else do I listen to? Blink-182. <laughs> I listen to Drake. I listen to The Smiths. Now that's quite far apart from each other. Talking Heads. I love Talking Heads. Drums. I love the drums. And then I like... Bieber. I don't I just know. <laughs> You no. can admit it, you can admit it, it's okay. I like a lot of music and you kind of have to when you DJ, so I've got you free vinyls now. I'm trying to get you into the vinyl scene. <laughs> <laughs> what is my favourite sports team? Do you have one? <laughs> he likes Norwich City. The most ugly coloured uniform. What is my eye colour? Brown. Yeah, the blue. Who is my best friend? Sarah. Yeah. Is yours either Christian or Tom? Mention both names now. I can't like you say can't one or the other. One. That's hard. Who would be your best man? Either one of those two. What is something you do 
but I wish you didn't. I think we've discussed this. Tap. And... Talk over you. Yeah. If I'm doing something and then you'll just come over and take over. You get it. very short with me. You get short with me though as well. <laughs> That's you. Where am I from? I've been told that your dad's half Scottish. Mm-hmm. That, that was a nice? terrible <laughs> And so that makes you half Chinese, quarter Scottish, quarter English. So I'm mostly Chinese, but I look like this. You're fully English. Your surname is French. Oh, this light's gonna go. Go explain. Turn it off then. <laughs> that was so not dramatic. <laughs> Carrying on with the questions, we're almost done. 27. What kind of cake would you bake me for my birthday? Kind of already done that. I didn't no. bake it. I'd try, but I wouldn't be very good at it. I'd probably just bake you like a chocolate cake. What cake do you like? Do you like... a sponge. <laughs> really? Classic, yeah. What about you? What cake no. do you like? I don't I'm really cake. eat too much cake. Do I play any sports? This sport-like no. physique that I have. No. no but you do have quite a sporty physique. Do I? People are always like, do you work out? Insinuating something sporty probably, but a you walk. don't actually do anything. You can actually do walking races, mm. but they're like... <laughs> you like to participate in yoga when you can. What can I spend hours doing? This. Filming. I've spent the past two days filming. <laughs> you tidy your room a lot. Well, look at it now. This is why I have to tidy my room. Or mm. like the halls I need to do all the try-ons for. You could spend hours doing like your music, like writing new songs or playing bass or guitar or probably scrolling online. I don't even look at things properly, I just scroll. The last question, if I could live anywhere, where would it be? If you really wanted to, you could. I think you like being in Norwich. Yeah, I think we both realised this with our trip to New York. Been there separately and we kind of went in colder months and both thought I'd love to live here one day. But then going there in the summer and how smelly and hot it was, it's made us realise how nice it is here. I've tried living away. I tried yeah. living in Leeds. I did it for a year. Home. Norwich. I'm glad you moved Norwich. back. Yeah. We became a thing. And we lived happily ever after. Those were the end of, of the questions. I think we should do boyfriend does my makeup and I do my boyfriend's makeup. Your lashes are so long. I want to put mascara on those beautiful lashes. So if you want to see that, then say in the comments below because you have kind of agreed to doing that. If enough people say it in the comments, then you'll have to do it. The public will demand But I've got a beard. You can't really do it. Yeah, Facial. there's like all the rest of the face here that I can beautify and you can do my makeup. Quite intrigued to see what you do to my face. You've got green hair, I'm going to make you look like the Joker. Please don't ruin my makeup when this <laughs> happens. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this. Please comment, like and subscribe and thank you for watching. Hi guys, welcome to my ASOS unboxing try on haul. Kind of Gucci-esque looking stuff about the Gucci prices.